The aggrieved Niger Delta ex-militants said they were in Benin to protest the non-documentation of some of their members by the federal government under the phase three of the amnesty program. They said the Nigeria Petroleum Development Company Limited is their only hope of reaching the federal government. The ex-militants emphasized that in 2011, the federal government disarmed them with a promise to document them into the amnesty programs, but alleged that up to now nothing has been done in that direction. They stressed that the privileges given to S militants in phase one and two should be accorded to them. Amnesty is one. They are supposed to attend to us the way they did the previous phases. We have three phases in amnesty program. Phase one and two have been properly taken care of. But that of the third phase, our phase, they left it just there. Imagine a situation whereby the federal government will ask you to drop your arms. They will document just you in the midst of 40 boys. It's absurd. I may ask government why they document some people, list of people. They're supposed to document everybody because everybody, everybody is leader that document. The same as a god, they don't give her a slot and document it. But some people now, they want to document it now. People that have document, we they document them. Because we are giving peace to the government since, since the day with the sound. In the year 2011, the federal government asked us, Niger Delta youths, to drop arms so that there will be peace in Niger Delta. On of which we obeyed their voice and dropped our arms. Then that resulted to phase three amnesty. By 2012, they came and document us. And when they came to document us, they did not document everybody. Somebody that dropped 50 arms, they give him just one slot. And if he drop 50 arms, by the right of amnesty law, one gun is two slots. If you drop 50 arms, it's supposed to be 100 slots. Security operatives on ground at the Benin head office of the Nigeria Petroleum Development Company Limited to prevent breakdown of law and order. Meanwhile, sources close to the MPDC office at Sapler Road, Benin, said though it is not in any way connected to the amnesty program of the federal government, it promised to China the grievances to the federal government. Patience, O Sayonabo, reporting.